Hey guys, what's up? It's Alexa. And right now, as you can probably tell, I am packing because I'm going to Fashion Week and I am so excited. So basically, I picked out three spring makeup looks that I'm pairing with three outfits and it's still gonna be freezing there. So the outfits are a little bit warmer, but the makeup is very like bold and spring and very on trend. So I need your help putting together which makeup look I'm gonna wear with which outfit. And I will make a vlog showing you guys the winning look and Without further ado, let me show you the looks and you can help me pick by leaving a comment down below. So for this look, I am wearing Nude Glow on my eyes. All the shadows are really shimmery and illuminating and very pretty and make your eyes pop. And I have a nice rosy glow in my cheeks and a little bit of bronzer. And then on my lips, I am wearing a big, bold color. Orange is huge for spring, so I really wanted to pull out Jenna, which is the shade on my lips. I have like a nice top knot to keep my hair back. What do you think? I think it looks really polished and pretty, but let me know. For this look, I decided to use the spring trend of pastels on my eyelids to create a bold look without going with the conventional bold lipstick. So I'm wearing a pale pink on my lips, but a bold shadow on my lids. And then on my cheeks, I'm wearing a shimmer brick to kind of make the look a little bit more glowy. And then I finished off with sleek straight hair to finish the whole look. I'm wearing big, tousled waves the Kajal Smoky Eyeliner, and a lip gloss and blush from the Uber Pink Collection, which is like a dusty, beautiful pink, and then kind of a bronzy pink on my cheeks. For this look, it's kind of like a grunge chic look. I paired a Givenchy t-shirt with an All Saints leather skirt, and um, some sheer tights, and some chunky booties from Topshop, as well as a faux fur wool coat. So for this look, it's kind of like a British rocker-ish look. Um, I paired my favorite All Saints leather jacket with a plain black tank top and a bold statement necklace, along with some plaid pants that kind of just make the look pop. And they're cuffed at the bottom, which is super on trend. And then some chunky Mary Janes to finish the look off. So what do you think? This look is kind of like a schoolboy androgynous, black and white, monochromatic, really kind of laid back, but still really chic. Um, I just paired a blouse with a bow on it to keep it feminine and girly with my favorite striped pants from Hudson, and I cuffed them to kind of elongate my legs a little bit more. And then I just threw on my favorite black oxfords, which are super comfortable and great if you are walking around a lot because they're very chic, but they are very practical as well. And then to keep me warm, I picked this wool coat. All right guys, these are my makeup and outfit options for Fashion Week. Recap, you saw a smoked rim liner, a bold orange lip, and a pastel blue eye. Plus, you saw three great fashion looks. You saw grunge chic, Brit pop, and boyish black and white. So, take your last look and tell me which makeup look and which outfit I should pair together and let me know in the comments down below because I will be reading them and I will be following up with the outfit that you guys pick in a vlog. See you at Fashion Week! BT Dubs, for more tips and how-tos, head to a Bobbi Brown counter for a personalized complimentary makeup lesson or head to the official Bobbi Brown YouTube channel.